What's good, everybody? It's your boy Pogo Dad. We are back at it because your boy's a pack at it, and guys, we're going to be getting into some Paldea Evolved Elite Trainer Boxes today. So on this side, we've got the regular Elite Trainer Box. This one comes with nine packs and a bunch of other goodies. The one on the right is going to be your Pokemon Center exclusive Elite Trainer Box, and it actually comes with two promos, and you get a couple extra packs in this one. But we're going to be getting into both of these today, and we're going to give you an idea of which one of these you might want to pick up. So guys, if you guys are ready, Let's go ahead and get into this video. Let's go ahead and start it off with the regular Elite Trainer Box. So these MSRP for around $49.99. Some places they're kind of a little bit more, you know, it kind of depends on where you go. But at the moment, you can actually pick these up on the secondary market for about 40 bucks. Nice. So yeah, there's the front of the box. There's the back if you guys want to see it. And it comes with all of these goodies. Let's go ahead and crack into it. But yeah, like I said, on the secondary market, these are actually going for around 40 bucks at the moment, which is a pretty decent deal, seeing as how you get some nice goodies and a really, really nice promo. Before we get into this, I have got to take a look at this player's guide because I haven't seen all the cards that are in this set. Let's take a little quick look because, like I said, I haven't seen them. So there we go. We got all the illustration arts. The biggest, baddest one right here is going to be your Magic Carp. At the moment, this is number one for me. Bax Caliber is the last one I need to complete my Comia artworks. Tyranitar looks beautiful. Man, all of these illustration arts are so freaking sick. All right, so we got all of these, and then we got our full arts. And coming around, we got a bunch more special illustration rares. We got the Skeledirge, looks nice. Got the Chiyu, and uh, yeah, man. Iono, number one card in the set at the moment. And then we've got some gold and we got a ton more gold. Wow, there's actually more gold in this set than I thought. But take a look at the box. Let's take a little 360. Got the nice Gen 9 starters on there. Let's take out this. And for the regular Elite Trainer box, you do end up with nine booster packs. You also get 65 card sleeves featuring the three starters, which looks really, really nice. You get a brick of 45 energy cards. You get your six damage counter dice and one competition legal coin flip die. You get your two condition markers in this little case. Also, you got these four dividers with different artworks on both sides. You get a code card for the online and then you get this sealed Pikachu promo. This is probably the one of the best promos of Scarlet and Violet so far with the three starters right here. And I gotta say, I love it. Here is also the Japanese version. I, I got it graded, but guys, let me know which one you like the best. Let's go ahead and stick our promo in the back and then we've got our nine packs. We'll go ahead and get into these and then we'll go ahead and see what's in the Pokemon Center exclusive, which in my opinion, I like the Pokemon Center exclusive just a little bit more because you get the better items. You get a couple more packs and uh, you know, it's not really that much more. But um, yeah, guys, how have you guys been liking Paldea Evolved? Let me know down in the comments. Um, it's been pretty decent so far. Not too bad. All right, we got a Hollow Wiggly Tough. All right. So yeah, we get nine booster packs, which feels a little bit better. You get one extra pack more than you used to get when we were in the Sun and Moon and Sword and Shield. Wow, I was brain farting. I couldn't even remember the last one. There's so many, so many eras. Are, are they start with an S? So they they all Sword and Shield. You got Scarlet and Violet, Sun and Moon. I mean, they all seem to kind of mix in together a little bit. All right, and we got an, another another Hollow. So yeah, you get a Hollow in every pack. But um, yeah, the promo, the promo card, that Pikachu. I really think it's a really good promo to be picking up right now. You know everybody's opening them up so you know usually at release that's when things are kind of there at their cheapest unless they you know reprint them to to oblivion <laughs> all right we got bosses orders can we get our first hit Ooh, there we go all right we got the lycan rock ex i think i i pulled this a, a few times we'll keep the hits up there to see maybe if we get more hits in this one than the other one which you know each each one of them is going to be random and i'm going to give you every single one of these code cards upside down but yeah i i'm really hunting for that bax caliber that's the last comia artwork that i need thanks to exalted ray for hooking me up with the uh, middle evolution i've right, got the full links we got that and we i got another hollow come on paldea you know we we opened up the three pack blisters like what was it about a week ago and wow we we basically went through that entire opening with with like one ex and one illustration art 
and I was like, oh my goodness. I, I've been hearing everybody talk about how these pool rates are insane, and I'm not seeing it. <laughs> I, now, now, don't get me wrong. When we open up the booster boxes, booster box pool rates have been off the charts. Like, like it, it's it's crazy how how good the pool rates were from a booster box. Like 13 hits from each booster box that I've opened so far. I mean, that's that's really really good compared to like. You know, Sun and Moon and other eras like that. All right, practice studio. Orthworm. Okay, so we got one EX. Let me know what you guys have been getting. Have you guys been getting any pulls from these ETBs? I haven't really seen too many openings. I can't lie. I, I haven't really watched any how they have evolved openings. It's, it's kind of weird. Not too many people have been uh, opening it from what I can tell. All right, we got the Vigoroth. Ooh, nice. We got the Flamingo. Flamigo. My bad. I, I, I you know, I, I can't read. And we've got the, ooh, we got the T-Tar. Could that be a premonition of things to come? All right. I like the Flamingo. That's kind of cool. I like that. I like it. All right. So we got one little illustration rare. Let's get it, baby. Appreciate you guys for checking out the video. And uh, yeah, let me know. What you guys think of the set so far? 151 dropped on the Pokemon Center this week and it sold out very, very quickly. I wasn't even able to get any. So hopefully they will restock that on the Pokemon Center. Oops, I dropped a pack. But um, yeah, I was able to get some of the UPCs. There's a new 151 UPC. I uh, ended up going to GameStop. So you can pre-order them in store. They said there was no limit, and you only have to put $5 down on each one. So I ended up getting three like I did with the Charizard. I think we'll probably... It's not set in stone, but I, I plan on giving one away here on the channel. So, yeah, definitely stay tuned. Subscribe to the channel. So now we've got the Pokemon Center exclusive Elite Trainer Box. So there it is. There's the front. It does have a different artwork on the front. And then on the back, that's what you should get on the inside. I'm going to go ahead and open this up and we'll show you what's the difference. Just like the regular ETB, all of these items are exactly the same. The main difference is you get two extra packs, so you get 11 booster packs, and then you get two promos. You get one that's just like the regular ETB, but then you get this one that has the Pokemon Center exclusive stamp right on the card. So that is the main difference. You get the code card, and then even the box, the box art and everything is exactly the same. And these, I like to keep my bulk in. So yeah, don't throw these away. You can store all your cards in there. Here's one more closer look at these promos. I think this is one of the most gorgeous promos I've ever seen. But yeah, there it is with the stamp and all. And let's go ahead and get into these 11 booster packs. And let's see if we can end this baby off with some heat. <laughs> go ahead, guys. Smash the like. Smashing the like is a proven fact. It will always bring the fire. The fire pools, at least. <laughs> but yeah, these were actually going for $59.99. They are since been sold out on the Pokemon Center. So you... I don't know if they're going to restock these or not, but right now on the second day market, these are at about $80 plus. So these, oh wow, okay. We got the Paldean Claude Sire EX full art coming out, pack number one. Okay, I mean, not not a huge pull, but it's a, it's a full art that we didn't have. Let's get it. But yeah, the, the Pokemon Center exclusive ETBs always seem to hold a little bit more value than your regular ETB. And uh, yeah, that's another thing to keep in mind. I always like to pick up the Pokemon Center exclusives myself. I like to at least buy two. I buy one to open up here on the channel and I buy one to hold, you know, just to put in my collection because, you know, I'm a hoarder and I like to hoard everything. <laughs> All right, we got the Glamora and a Jump Bluff. Okay, so nothing there. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Would you would you get the regular or the Pokemon Center exclusive? Me, like I said, uh, it's almost kind of nice to get it like a case. Get like a case of the Pokemon Center exclusives. You can open one maybe or just to hold them. I mean, like I said, they do hold a little bit better value than the regular. I mean, I'm not a financial advisor by no means, so don't take anything I say with a grain of salt but you know i'm just you know I'm, tr I'm trying to give you guys a little bit better insight of you know how i'm starting to think at least you know I, I i usually don't get rid of anything i i hoard it all 
But, um, you know, there's there's some times when you might have to let it go. You know, a, a, a certain bill might come up, you know. Things happen. I know it's happened to me a lot. <laughs> a lot lately, that's for sure. All right, we got a choice belt. Come on, let's get some pools. We got a Shinx and a Slack King. Let's not be slacking in the pools. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! All right, so here we go. Another pack. Another code for you guys. Let me know what you guys are getting on that online. And, uh, yeah. But, yeah, how they evolve. We got, what is it? What is the next set? The Charizard set's going to be coming up pretty soon, I think. And then we got the 151 already. Pre-orders are coming up for that. Oh, what do we got here? Ooh, we got the Chiyu EX. All right, so we got the goldfish. Not the big goldfish, but we got the little goldfish. We'll take a goldfish. All right, let's keep it moving, guys. Let's keep it moving. But yeah, 151, that's the talk of the town right now. Um, I'm going to attempt to get some in Japanese. But I will not be paying inflated prices. I'm going to try to, you know, try to get it through a through a proxy site. That way I can I can get it for as cheap as possible. All right, we got a Faulkner and we got this. All right, I haven't I don't think I've pulled that hollow before. But yeah, prices for 151 Japanese boxes I've seen them all the way up to 180 dollars. Don't go out there and pay that, guys. I mean, you could almost buy any card you wanted from the set for 180 bucks. Honestly, I think the the biggest card in the set is the uh, Erica special illustration art, and I think that one. I you know I, I'm not even gonna say prices because I don't even know. But um, yeah, I, I honestly, I'm gonna tell you guys what I'm gonna do. There's a there's a few cards that I really want from that set. I'm just gonna buy the singles. The singles have come down to a decent. <laughs> a decent price i think i'm just gonna you know see see what i can get for the price of a box i think i can get a bunch of nice cards what do you guys think i've right, got a luxio oh <laughs> yo let's freaking go golden skeleton ex with a luxury all right so that's not bad guys we got a full art we got a gold Skeledurge. There we go. Now we can get into the Skeledurge pack. We got three more booster packs, guys. Let's get it, baby. Yo, that's pretty hype. That is very hype. We, uh, me and my sons went to GameStop the other day when we went to go pre-order the uh, 151 UPCs. We all opened up a pack, and my son opened up his pack, and it had the golden uh, Quackleval. Yeah, golden Quackleval. And uh, that was pretty sick. That was pretty sick. He was pretty hype. But I... <laughs> He, he wasn't hyped when he found out what the value was. He was like, how is this gold card worth five bucks? Which, you know, I kind of pointed it out to him. Yeah, he loved it though. You know, regardless, it's a gold card. I, I, I like the gold. Gold is good, in my opinion. All right, we got the Grusha. Got that, and we got that. Here we go, guys. Last pack to end this video off. Let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can end it off with some last Packy magic one to the front. Here we go. We got him a champ energy, baby. It's a sign. It's a sign. All right, we got the great ball. We got a dung beetle rolling a poop up the hill. Pacivian Tyranitar reverse. We'll take it. Quaxly. Again, let's take another look at that promo. I love the Pikachu with the starters. I like this one just like the one in the sword and shield. It was beautiful. But yeah, guys, that's going to do it. Let me know what you guys think. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to smash that like. Subscribe if you guys are new. And I'll see you guys in the next one.